Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to steal a bottle for your reborn babies or your baby doll. Um, I have this Nook bottle here. Um, and if you guys want to know how I make my milk, then just please put that in the comments down below. And I'll be very greatly um, appreciated and I'll do that for sure. Um, so first of all, you need a bottle of course. And, but this bottle is already sealed. Um, it's not the best sealing job ever. You can see it. But it does all, go all the way to the nipple. And you can barely tell that it's there. Um, first of all, it's going to be in their, in their mouth anyways. So it doesn't really matter. But, yeah. And I just made this milk too. So. And it's two ounces. But not that that matters. So this bottle will just be... Sitting in the background there for this video, and the bottle that I shall be sealing today is this bottle right here. Now, I'm going to take all that out, and I'm going to put it into this bottle, because I have already sealed this bottle, too. So. And I don't believe I've tested it since um, I sealed it, so I don't know how this is going to work out, but... Alright, so now that that's in there... Um, um, you can see that every um, playtex has a different um, top so you know and you can tell so like this one fits on here because this is that one this one fits on there but you know it's hard to take off that it can't barely take it out so this one easy to put on easy to take off this one I'm going to be sealing This one's already sealed. Oops. This one's already sealed. So. That works fine. This milk is ugly though. I need to change out this milk. Yeah, I have this Playtex Nurser. And this Playtex Bandier. So, these are the only two Playtex bottles that I have. But. That's okay, because they're cool. I like them. Alright, so. Let's see your bottles. Of course, you need to take the top off. And you don't need the bottle, so. And I've already sealed the bottom of this bottle, so if you guys want a. What is that? I don't know. But if you guys want a video of how I seal my bot the bottom of a Playtex Vintair or the bottom of a man, you just put that in the comments down below. And all this is just extra. So, since the, um, hold on, let me just show you, mm, I'm just going to take it out anyways, because, um, I just like to take it out, and I'm going to, um, put this inside out so I can dry it off really quick, hold on, okay. nipple all dry well if it was dry already anyways <laughs> you're just gonna I'm sorry I'm just in love with that bottle right now I just really like it okay so um yeah anyways, okay, so, that's good. so now you just want to make sure that it is coming out okay so what I do is I just stick it to the top of the nipple just like so and I squeeze it. And squeeze it really hard. Till some starts coming out of the nipple. Till some starts coming out of the nipple. And I just squeeze some into there. And take it out. And then I just kind of rub the top there. There we go. And what that does is it just keeps it, um from it not falling out and it also just helps it seal and not leak so yeah that was my pet fix my dear so yeah okay I'm gonna put it down.
and the thing with the Nook bottles and I'm sure other bottles too and the Playtex bottles is they have this top and it pushes down on the nipple well I don't want my nipple to get um, glued to the top of my top my thing um, you can just attach the top to the bottom of it and it doesn't have to have the top on but I want to have the top on mine so I'm just going to screw the top on I basically just flip the nipple inside out and then put the top on and then you're done and then you gotta let that sit in the silicone that you want to have um the best is to use it well if you have um pla not pla if you have um latex bottles then you don't have to use clear but if you have clear nipples as shown here you would probably want to use silicone that's clear Oops. clear silicone three at 30 minute rain ready but um i normally wait overnight and stuff it says w waterproof sunproof freeze proof flexible it says that um it's a lifetime guarantee it will not shrink crack break down wash away or yellow but i've actually had a bottle yellow before so um but that was because i didn't wait overnight first of all didn't wait overnight i right after i put it in there i put milk in there which was um what i have in this bottle here and if you want to know what i have in that bottle then go to check out my other video that i'll probably post in after this video because um i just want to make that video so bad but you know anyways yeah it yellowed because i just put it milk in there right away and i didn't let it dry and like turn the whole entire nipple yellow so it's stained for life but you know that's okay because i still love the bottle i'll show it to you guys it is what is it i can't find it oh there it is I mean, tell that the nipple, well, like, you can't really see in the video, but, like, it's, like, like, the nipple up here is yellow. Yeah, you guys can't see. But, hold on, let me turn this light off. Yeah, you can kind of tell that it's yellow now. I know the light, it looks horrible in here without that light on, so, keep it on. So yeah, this is a parent's choice bottle, so. Probably a reason why I did that, maybe, I don't know. But yeah, that was the bottle that I have that yellowed. So, see you guys in my next video. I'm just going to be showing you how I make my milk for my bottles. Bye!